Who did you turn to when you saw that there was no place for you in the, in the 11 and you traveled to England, you didn't get to play at all? Was there one person you called or spoke to, sort of confided in about how you were feeling? I didn't speak to anyone during the tour. Um, I called up uh, Rahul sir after the tour. Uh, he is, he's been someone who's always been there for me. Uh, he's uh, someone that I've really gotten close to. and. Uh, He's someone that I can call at any time if I need anything. My dad keeps calling me and asking me, why aren't you playing? You should be playing. And then I was like, you know, it's not my decision to make. You don't seem to have become bitter at all after all these setbacks, which perhaps goes to show how you are mentally and how you look at life. You know, uh, uh, I think there's, there's times that you have to move on from and uh, you can't keep holding on to things forever. Yeah, it does stay with you for some time, but then uh, for you to move on and do, do well from there, you have to erase that from your head and you know look forward and look what, look at what you can do uh, to improve that or change that. And for me, it's, this season is just about going out there, starting off from scratch, playing the Ranji Trophy, play it like I'm making my debut again in the Ranji Trophy and try and uh, replicate those three continuous hundreds that I got.